So question 73, area between two curves. There's definitely going to be some integration here. So we're trying to find the area between a curve and a line. The curve is a cubic equation. A line is a straight line. Um, so the um, I don't know exactly what it looks like, but let's um, let's hazard a guess. Let's say that the cubic is the green line, and for the moment, let's assume that the red line, the linear equation, cuts the green line in three distinct places. It may be that that's not the case, but um, we'll assume that that's the case for the time being. So the key thing is to find the points of intersection. And we do that by setting x cubed minus 5x squared plus 16x minus 3 equal to 10x minus 3. And when we solve that equation, we simplify first. And quite happily, we've got x as a common factor here. So we can take the x outside as a factor rather than having to um, concern ourselves with any other method of solving this equation, let's say the um, uh, factor theorem or what have you. So there's the factorized form, and I can then factorize this quadratic expression further to give me the three factors. So there are indeed three points of intersection. Um, this tells me that uh, they intersect when x equals zero. This tells me they intersect when x equals two and x equals three. So that's the graph with the three points of intersection. So the area enclosed is this area here. So I need to integrate um, the, uh, the, to find this section, I'm going to integrate the green line minus the red line, f of x minus g of x, if you like. And so I'm integrating from x equals zero to x equals 2, the green line minus the red line with respect to x. And when I do that, I could do this longhand or I could cheat with my calculator and get the answer 8 thirds. Then when I do the same thing for the interval from x equals 2 to x equals 3, um, I'm expecting if I integrate the green line minus the red line again, I'm expecting that I would get a negative answer. So when I, when I integrate from two to three, the same function as before, I do indeed get a negative answer, minus five twelfths. And then the area enclosed between the two curves is eight thirds plus five twelfths, which is 37 over 12 square units. So that's the way I did it. It would have been possible on the second integral to integrate the red curve minus the green curve, and then you'd have got a positive number and you could have just added them to get the same answer. Okay, hope you did well with that question.